Good evening. Happy Game Awards night. As you all know, it is a very fancy night and all the stars are out. I'm actually broadcasting live from backstage. I'm in front of a green screen to make you all feel more at home. I got an exclusive invite from Jeff and boarded a private Jane, uh, a private plane, a private jet immediately. Oh, hi. Hi. It's Wonder. Pikmin 4. It has to be Wonder. Super Mario Brothers Wonder. One for one. Nothing brings a family together more than trying to rescue an, an empire, a, a kingdom in distress from the evil likes of Bowser. That was a pretty bad ad read. Okay, yes, good. I love this guy. I mean, I don't love the look, but I trust this dev. I love the, uh, the hex. Oh, this is a programming ass game? FFV! How do I get in the game? I gotta hit him up. <laughs> oh, I like this. Oh, it's Pony Island! Huh. 25 or 6. Okay. Dude, Pony Island is a good-ass game. It's a little, like, old now. Like, it, it's... I don't know. It feels kind of trite, but it was one of the first games to do all that stuff. Yeah, I guess it's a it's gotta be a mobile game, right? But we're in the mobile game section. Oh, is that oh the matchless kung fu. Alright, well you guys might see an ad on my YouTube for that soon. So don't play it till I tell you to, okay? I just realized Jeff Keeley is doing bounties. Oh my god, that's what this is. Here with another award. This time for innovation and accessibility. That shit Mortal Kombat, bro. Massive, Please. Honestly, Dude, it it's gotta be Mortal bigger. Kombat. That and shit is so funny. Zombies. Why Mortal Kombat? You can turn on, uh, in, in the accessibility, you can turn on a descriptor of the fatality that you're doing. And they explain it. It is extremely funny. Imagine not seeing a single thing in your entire life and then getting explained how Raiden kills you. It's Mortal Kombat 1. Forza Motorsport. What? The car game? I guess if you're blind, you can't... Drive, so it's not Dota Evo. It should be Evo. It's not Evo. And 2023 League of Legends World Wow! Iron hey, Mouse. I'm right here. People make games. Quack it. Hey, go on. Screen. Take and the right in vote. Huh? I have 2,400 people in here who say it's me, two. which might be a Twitch record. 2,400 is a lot of people. So, what is with the Iron, Iron Mouse? Mouse be, here be yourself, Cole. Oh shit, World of Goo! What a beautiful I love World of Goo. This is like one of my uh, favorite games for the Wii. That shit came out a long time ago. How do you make another World of Goo? That was such a basic game. Stop hating? I like World of Goo! I said it was good! Relax! Oh, actually, that shit. Dynasty Warriors. Actually, it's Persona again. I actually don't mind this. <laughs> Is he skating? Okay. Gab, 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 gab. Okay. That's me watching Persona. Yup. An incredibly special guest, a legendary actor. It's Kojima again. A very special guest. How did they get Gonzo but nobody else? Is Gonzo the best gaming Muppet, I guess? That seems kind of fucked up to me, right? Oh, here he is again. Okay, all right. Hold on. All right, buddy. All right. What are we thinking, man? What a card. Go. Good evening, everybody. My speech was actually longer than this year's Call of Duty campaign. Whoa! Good one, Gamer Jones, got him. You know, I think after playing Alan Wake 2, one of them should have gotten something. Did you write these pages, Mr. Oh wait, they did. <laughs> she was good, she was good. Cody looks like one of the nominees. Oh, if I get it. Neil Nubar. Dude, Baldur's Gate is gonna sweep tonight, and I have not played the game. I my ass does not know what's going on. Baldur's sweep? Yeah, look at the security. Look. At 
They are ready. I just noticed all the bald men, all the security guys right here standing at the front. This is the Baldur's Gate guy, right? Okay, he's cool. All right, switching gears. Our next world premiere comes from a small independent team of developers in Australia. I love that this show can give a platform to independent creators. Wait. Their last game in 2019 was a sensation. Oh. And their next project 2019. is equally exciting. No. Head to TGASteamDeck.com right now. We're doing another Steam Deck giveaway. This oh, time it's the yeah. brand Wait new one terabyte TGA Steam Deck OLED Steam featuring Deck. HDR com. OLED display. Enter now only during the live show at TGASteamDeck.com for a chance to Ain't win one of no 100 OLEDs. Way. All right, truck. <laughs> this is kind of scary, actually. I hope it's the Alan Wake. I get it's probably both. Together. Alan Wake 2. Yes, it is Alan Wake 2. Yes. It absolutely deserves to win. I normally wouldn't care about these kind of games or narratives, but this game is delivered extremely well. All right, that was a good one. You got me. Well played, Jeff. Yeah, well, thank you. Seriously, though. <laughs> I won't lie, this is silly playing, to me. You know what? If I'm honest, well, this is very silly. Lots and lots of Tears of the Kingdom. This is silly. What an incredible game. His ass you know is that not one playing Tears where you of the Kingdom. The cuckoo up a hill? Please wrap it up. We had to cut the Sam Lake yeah, speech maybe. so Gonzo could run bits. What do you think, Zelda? Please, God, this is their one nominee, dude. Their one nomination. It has to be. Cocoon is gonna win, actually. Cocoon is gonna win. No, Cocoon is gonna win, I think. What a sick fucking game, though. God, man. And not what? That's Cooking Mama. I already played that. That's not a debut. The game award goes to Cocoon. <sighs> Obviously, it's Cocoon, which doesn't feel fair. Like that's by the fucking the inside guys, right? Or Limbo or whatever. Cocoon is a great game, but come on. No way. Oh, it's Shinobi. Okay. Let me reintroduce it. Really? Yeah, dude, yes. Oh, dude, yeah, yeah. I want all that. Really? Really? <laughs> no way. Are you serious? That's amazing. They're making good games again! They just went back to the old games that are good games! Oh, yeah. now, That's fucking awesome! Alan Wake 2, I don't know, actually. Rise of P, I don't know. Mario Brothers Wonder, this could go a couple different ways. I think it's Zelda, Mario, though. I would say Mario, but... And the game award goes to... It could go to a couple. Alan Wake 2! Yes. That's fine. Congrats, Remedy. Is it and tonight, <laughs> I am so, so honored to it's share Kojima. this latest yep. update with you. Yep, here it is. On his upcoming project. He loves this here guy. In crack and demand whale. It's cold. Shut up. That's <laughs> it. Okay. I, I did not follow Kojima through uh, Death Stranding. I was like, wow, he really lost his touch. But that... <laughs> I was wrong. He's back. I was wrong. I'm, I'm so, I was so wrong. Doubters in shambles. I was a doubter. I was a doubter. Why does Kony hate Death Stranding? Because I never played it. <laughs> I li I'm listening to the opinions of YouTubers. You should too. Listen to me. And it is a game. Don't get me wrong, but it's at the same time a movie, but at the same time a new form of media. Oh. Oh. Wait, wait. Is is there somebody else at the door? Is Peel making the game too? Everyone, please welcome <laughs> Jordan Peel to the Kojima verse. <laughs> Kojima verse. I can just, I can say from the first moment I played Metal Gear Solid 2. Okay. Right. I knew I was experiencing the work of an artist whose craft just hits different. Well, and for better or worse. To me. Cool. <laughs> I'm excited for this. I like Peel. Yes. 
Uh, I sometimes like Kojima. Why do we oh, keep going to this fucking night? Who is that? Ooh, I like that guy. He looks cool. Oh my god. I like these enemies. Sure. We spent a lot of journey to the West games. There should be a game like this, but it's the Bible. Coney, all your ideas are ex-mythology should be a Souls like. Have I ever been wrong? Though? Seriously. There is so much more Game Awards ahead. You thought the surprises were done? Nope, there's lots coming. <laughs> but while you're here, Jeff, don't put words in my mouth. Bro, so you thought the surprises were done? Well, no, Jeff. It's, Super it's, World it's 9 30. I thought you had more surprises. My eyes would not go in there. I will say, I heard this park is not fun. There's one ride. And it's not good. <laughs> I'll wait for the Donkey Kong part. Super I'll Nintendo wait for Orlando, actually. Now, I'm waiting for Universal Orlando. Studios Hollywood. <laughs> no, thank you. No, thank you. No, thank you. I don't think I will. So is a little bit of a twist. They're about to play music from an upcoming game that no one has heard yet. You might call it one of those world premieres, and this is a special one. It's written by one of the greatest video game composers of all time, the legendary Nobuo Utamatsu. Here is the Game Awards Orchestra, led by Lauren Balf, with lead vocals from it's Lauren tactics. Allred, from Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. <sighs> Enjoy. Boo! Never before seen game. It is weird that we live in a post Final Fantasy VII remake society. Because, like, that was always Square's, like, ace in the hole. But that's not all we have tonight for Final Fantasy fans. It's gotta be tactics. Give me tactics, Jeff. What we've done, that's set in stone. Or so they'll tell you, Dean. Oh, she's Irish! Because the future Ugh. has the. Strap in, Newty. Things are about to get mighty interesting. Wait, that's not. Oh. <laughs> it took me a second. <laughs> okay, I get it now. I get it. Okay. All right, I get it. It took me a second. I was like, wait a minute. Okay. All right. It, I Weird, but okay, sure. That's fun. Cocoon, Dave the Diver, Dredge, <laughs> Sea of Stars, Dave and the Newfie. Diver. And the Game Awards Boo. goes to Sea of Stars. I heard that game's very good, too. Heard Sea of Stars. For best Coney, you look cool. Thank you. Uh-oh, surely this is it. Pop it. Pop it. Oh, it's Arcane. Wait. Wait. I like the arts, though. Oh, he's a vampire. It's not. Lock up tight now. Wait. Nights just get. No. Really? That's fucking cool. Dude, that's actually really cool. I'm not even a Marvel guy. I don't care about Marvel, but like Marvel games is our an arcane Mar Blade game. World class talent sounds cool. Characters that they love. Oh! No, Mr. Howard. Good catch, buddy. Yeah, but we should probably hurry this up. I don't think we can breathe. Yeah, how you doing, big man? Right. That's really right. good. Why okay, me? What so a strange year, shot. Where did that come from? Dude, that was out of no. I just got headshot from across the fucking planet. Here's the kingdom gets the it. And Baldur's Gate 3 gets game of the year. No Spider Man. Legend of Zelda, Tears of the Kingdom. I was feeling Spider Man there, but. Because it's just Breath of the Wild again, right? But. I guess not really. Here's the knight. Is the knight gonna present? Advance Wars 1 and 2 oh, Reboot man. Camp. Give it to me. City Skylines you know what I 2, want, Jeff. Let me have it. Fire Emblem Give it to Engage me. and Pikmin 4. Give me the game I want. And the game award goes to Pikmin 4. Let's fucking go. Yes. 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 Correct. That is correct, Jeff. Good choice. Well, now to present Game of the Year from the upcoming films Wonka and Dune Part 2, please welcome YouTuber Modded Controller 360. Okay, yeah. The Lies of P Kid, yeah. 
Yeah, in case you guys didn't know, he used to mod 360 controllers apparently back in the day. Yeah. The, uh, Fun bit. <laughs> that pinned message. Timothy Shalom? <laughs> if I had to rank them, well, I only played two of them. <laughs> I played Alan Wake and Wonder. I'd probably put Wake over Wonder, but they're both very good. Oh, wait, it's the flute guy. That's the dude that goes foolish. What the fuck is that? Uh oh, big ass flute. Big ass flute. Ain't never seen a flute like this. I can't even hear him. Is he even playing? And the game of the year is. Baldur's Gate 3. It is, isn't it? I suppose it is. Here he comes, Sir Baldur. <laughs> Sir Balder stepping up to the stage. There he is. Sir Balder the Mighty. Sir Balder the Crunch Lord. <laughs> He's not on the dev team. They just know he can't years, fight a knight. <laughs> uh, on this game, in sometimes very difficult circumstances, this was our COVID game. Slug finals with uh, Pizza Tower. In, uh, last month. Actually, wait. Um, Actually, uh, game of the year is Pizza so Tower. And then they come up to the Pizza Tower uh, music. Uh-oh. Wait a minute! Somebody else has something to say! Is somebody coming to the stage? Oh no! Oh, here he goes! 